Hello Church. Today we're going to be looking at Command 7, which is the Lord's Supper. The command comes from Matthew 26, verses 26 through 28, which goes as follows. Now as they were eating, Jesus took bread, and after blessing it, broke it and gave it to the disciples and said, Take, eat, this is my body. And he took a cup, and when he had given thanks, he gave it to them, saying, Drink of it, all of you, for this is my blood of the covenant which is poured out for many for the forgiveness of sins. So we can see here we're doing this in remembrance of Christ, that he traded his righteousness for our sin, that he poured out his blood to cover our sins. We're doing this to lift him up and to praise him and to acknowledge everything that he's done for us. The story today is Jesus' Last Supper, which comes from Luke 22, verses 7 through 20. Then came the day of the unleavened bread, on which the Passover lamb had to be sacrificed. So Jesus sent Peter and John, saying, Go and prepare the Passover for us, that we may eat it. They said to him, Where will you have us prepare it? And he said to them, Behold, when you have entered the city, a man carrying a jar of water will meet you. Follow him into the house that he enters, and tell the master of the house, The teacher says to you, Where is the guest room? where I may eat the Passover with my disciples. And he will show you a large upper room furnished. Prepare it there. And they went and found it just as he had told them. And they prepared the Passover. And when the hour came, he reclined at table and the apostles with him. And he said to them, I have earnestly desired to eat this Passover with you before I suffer. For I tell you, I will not eat it until it is fulfilled in the kingdom of God. And he took a cup and when he had given thanks, he said, Take this and divide it among yourselves. For I tell you that from now on I will not drink of the fruit of the vine until the kingdom of God comes. And he took bread, and when he had given thanks, he broke it and gave it to them, saying, This is my body, which is given for you. Do this in remembrance of me, and likewise the cup after they had eaten, saying, This cup that is poured out for you is the new covenant in my blood. So, guys, Passover had to be done year after year, plus all the other sacrifices that went on daily at the temple. They had to continually sacrifice and cover sin, sacrifice and cover sin. But Christ is the true spotless sacrifice that covers all sin forever if we only put our trust in him. So he is the real lamb. He is the one and only the ultimate sacrifice that covers all of our sin. All we have to do is put our faith in him and follow him. Guys, we want to take a church-wide Lord's Supper on April 19th. We'll still be doing our virtual services, but if you guys will get prepared, if you'll get juice and bread and be ready to take the Lord's Supper with us on April 19th, we would love to do that as a church body. I will talk to you guys on Monday.